Hey guys, what's up? This is your girl Gabby of Truly Gab and thank you so much for rocking with me. If you are new here, hey girl, hey, make sure you subscribe, comment down below and like this video. If you're new and you're looking for just a new um, person to look at on YouTube, I welcome you. We do a lot of fashion over here, do a lot of vlogs as well and lifestyle type content. So definitely make sure you take some time and subscribe to my video because I would love to chat it up with you and we continue to grow the platform over here. So today we're going to be doing a clothing haul, my favorite, favorite thing. And it's going to be uh, from Shein. I actually have not did a Shein video in a really long time it's been several months i think before summer or right at summer so i had to go grab some of their winter gems that they had and so i'm gonna show you guys what i have purchased some of these items actually go really well together on accident or uh maybe i picked them out to go together on purpose i can't remember but they go good together now uh and so i want you guys to see how i pair them how i style each individual piece i may do a lookbook on, on down the road road but this video is just a haul to show you guys what i got and what my first thoughts are so i already have on the first outfit if you would like to see what i have please stay tuned and please do me a favor and comment down below just telling me what your favorite piece is of the haul and make sure you uh subscribe let's get into it all right guys let's go ahead and get into it all these items will be linked down below and i will also remember uh to put the sizing down below as well we're gonna start off with the top as well as some bottoms. Uh, so this top is called a crop sweater with a knitted tank top. And the bottoms are called um, a high waist split hem pants. The bottoms I got in a 2X and the top I got in a 1X. So just to show you guys this top, cause this top is everything. It's a beautiful cream color. Can you guys see that? And you can see all the texture in this top. It is beautiful. So it is two separate pieces. So this is the crop top. So this is the crop top. It's not connected whatsoever to the tank top. So you're gonna get two separate pieces here. Um, and it is so cute. I'll turn around in the second. And this is the tank top. I actually tucked it in my pants, but let me show you guys what it looks like all the way out. So it's a full length tank top. It covers your stomach if you wanna wear it out like this. That is totally fine that's the look but um i like it more so tucked in for this specific look i think it's a vibe and it looks so good um but it is so cute again i got this in a 1x and it fits me really really good one thing about shein is that um i think that for the most part they're around true to size so uh, some of the items i got i got outside of my size but i Think they should still work I don't know but um let's let's move on back and show you guys these bottoms I'm actually gonna put my camera down a little bit so you guys can see the bottoms okay so these are the bottoms and I love this color it's this perfect um caramel brown color bottoms and at the ankle they are split so that's why they call the split hem pants but they are so cute and trendy these are 2x and they fit me just fine they do have a good amount of stretch in them um so you should be good whatever size you pick they do have like an elastic band at top as well so it's going to hold you in so i really do enjoy these pants all right just in case you're interested in the entire look i'm gonna step back and show you guys the entire look you can check my mirror out as well to give you a different um, view as well, but this is so cute. I love this look. Put on a gold necklace, some gold banglets, and some rings. It is a vibe for me. This, this is the way you start off a Shein haul. Don't know how it's gonna end, but this is how you start it off. Let's get to the next. Moving right along. So I'm actually gonna have to stand this way for right now. So this is called um, a plunging neck lantern sleeve drawstring, not front um, peplum top in a size zero XL. I can tell you where I went wrong at. <laughs> One, I have no breasts, so I wasn't gifted in that area. 
Two, I probably should have went up a size to a 1XL. Um, warning, I'm saying this for my mom because my mom is going to call me as soon as she sees this and just be like, throw it away. I know, this is probably going to have to go to my sister or something like that, but it was so cute on the model. Um, let me show you guys what it looks like on the, the model because uh, I say I'm going to insert a picture, but then I don't because I forget. Um, you guys see that? Can you guys see that? Yay, nay, probably not. Uh, but it's so cute. So let me fix it and I'm gonna turn right around. Hold on. I'm, let me step back so, <laughs> so y'all can see. Okay, I have a mirror right there. So y'all probably, okay, so this is what the top looks like. I already put a safety pin in it because I was just like overly, overly exposed. I may not even keep this part in because it's just not for me. Um, so let me, yeah, let me just hold it like that so you guys can see, okay? Here we go, start it right here, Gabby. Um, so this top, as you can see, it is plunge neck. It does have the drawstring in the front, uh, but it's just way too open for me. I put a safety pin in it. I have to hold it down so I'm not exposed. I think one of the things that I need is like double-sided tape or like, like breast tape or something like that to stick so that the shirt will just lay right. I may actually order that. Um, but it's really cute. It's a really pretty color. The drawstring is functional. If I move too much, something gonna pop out. So let me hear you. Drawstring is uh, is uh, functional and it does have your puffy, puffy sleeve. So let me spin right around so you guys can see this. Such a cute look, especially with these bottoms. This is cute, but yeah. It's just too much. So I'll see you guys on the next one. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are back after the lavender top, which was so cute, but it just didn't work out for me. And I put back on my first outfit and to show you guys this tie cuff split uh, back trench coat. It is everything. If you don't get anything from this haul, make sure you get this entire look because it is perfect. I'm gonna step back in a second to show you guys, but I wanna show you guys up front just like the detailing of it. It is like a suede-ish material um, on there. So you can see it's like very velvety and beautiful. Here's the tie cuff sleeves that they're referring to. So it comes two long ties. You just tie them yourself and it is super cute. It's on both um, sleeves. It does have your traditional trench coat look at the front with all of these like little pleats and just overlays at the front of the coat. And so you do have your two functional pockets as well. When I step back to show you the back, you're gonna see that it's gonna split in the back. So let me show you guys this entire look. Again, this is a vibe, this is a look, and I'm loving it. All right guys, moving right along. This next item is called a snake skin cami top and split skirt set. Uh, what size did I get this in? I got this in a size 2X, and this is definitely not traditional me because it's green. But it is so pretty. I'm gonna step back in a second for you guys to see, but I want you to see the detailing. Uh, if you guys, my light may be too bright. You guys see that detailing? It is so pretty. And the top is more like, it's like a loose top up there, but it's pretty. Put you on some jewelry and you're good to go. The straps are spaghetti straps, but they are adjustable. So you can, you can move it or tighten it or uh, loosen it however you please. Now let's get into this skirt. Y'all see this leg? Uh, so this skirt is so cute and comfortable and I think it just um, shapes me fairly well because it does have an elastic band at the top. I got this in a size 2X like I said but I should have gotten it in the 1XL but it's okay I have enough room and it fits me. It fits me just fine. It's really pretty stretchy material um, and so let me go ahead and do a 360 for you guys to see this look. This is really cute. 
and it's it's the perfect length of a skirt too it's not too long put you on some booties or some heels and you are good to go but i really enjoy this and again it's outside of my comfort zone and that's what i like and that's what i was going for pair this with the trench jacket that i just showed you guys and i'm really good for a date night let's go to the next all right guys moving right along and getting to it so these next pieces that i'm going to show you are a top and a bottom and they both come from shein the bottoms is called a button up corduroy skirt and it's size 2xl and then the top is called a off the shoulder twist front latrin sleeve bodysuit and a 1xl um i should have um of course i will say this i should have sized down but it is what it is i'm not returning it i'm keeping it sized down in the bottoms but it's okay but let's talk about this top this top is a body suit so let me show you um uh, i'm not Take it off my clothes mom i promise but as you can see it is like a, a full body suit top um and if you look at the top it is so stinking cute so as i try to get my skirt button back up oh lord the love of fashion hauls um so if you look at the top it does have um, this very beautiful um, net detailing. I will say this is wiring at the top of the, the top in your breast area. So it's gonna secure and, and help keep you up. The top, is, oh, excuse me, the sleeves are so cute. Like they said, it is like those, those balloon or Latin latrin sleeves. And it is so cute. Very elegant, basic black silk top. And um, here's the knot in the front of the top, if you can see that, which they were referring to in the title. So let's get to this skirt, it's so fun. So this is a corduroy skirt, um, and it does have the buttons all the way um, down the front. Of course, it looks like I missed a button or two, but it's okay. Um, it does button all the way down, and it's your traditional corduroy type. Um, skirt uh, material, excuse me. So it's so cute. I paired these two together. You can certainly wear them separately. I think this top will be really cute, all black, so with some jean, all black jeans on, um, put you on an all black blazer. That is so sexy and cute. But I like them two together as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn around to give you ladies a full look. cute put you on some high boots with this um, and you are good to go for for the night so all right keep it moving. well let's move it right along so this next item that I'm going to show you are um double button plaid tweed shorts um the top is still the same top that I had on I had on a while ago but uh these shorts are so cute I know what you're thinking Gabby it's too cold to wear shorts yes it is but if you're going on a tropical vacation this is a look. Also, put on some tights with it. Uh, like, you know, some stockings or tights, whatever you want to call it, and put you on some booties with a blazer. I have a whole idea for this look, so that's why I got it. Trust me, it works for the winter time. So, looking at these shorts, it is that tweed style. So, it is so beautiful. A lot of texture going on, as well as with the buttons. Let me make sure you guys can see. Okay. Right area, as well as the button details um, on the side. So it is so cute. Um, it does have a zipper on the side in order for you to get into the bottoms and feel comfortable with them on. I am rocking a 2XL in these shorts and they fit me pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a 360 for you guys to see this look. baggy on me up, up front but I'm okay with that because everywhere else um they fit me pretty pretty good so I actually think these were a win okay guys so I am super excited about this one because this is so cute so this is a pick up a pick a boo front drawstring side um satin dress and a 2xl and it is so stinking cute. So I'll step back in a minute, but just to give you guys a little bit of detail, this is where the peekaboo effect comes in because there is a cutout there. There are drawstrings on the side of, the, of the, the, the dress, so you can just tighten it to make it a little bit shorter if you wanted it or loosen it to make it a little bit longer. Definitely satin material. Like, 
it is definitely a beautiful satin material and with the um with the arms it is gonna be like an off the shoulder but i would imagine if you're not comfortable with that you can pull them up but they're just gonna slide back down so don't do that <laughs> So don't do that and so it is super super cute so now i'm gonna step back to give you ladies the full look of this dress so if you can see on the side here there are some drawstrings and again that's just pull it tighter to make it a little shorter or loosen it to make it a little longer in the back there is some rouging going on which i love because it makes my back side look really really good so let me go ahead and do a 360 of this look This is like really cute guys. It is so cute. Again, I am wearing a 2XL and I'm so glad I got it in a 2XL because it fits me really, really good. I think we have two more items to go. And then we'll go ahead and make this real quick. <laughs> like real quick. So this one that I have on is called a contrast uh, stitched rhinestone lace up uh, front top. Okay, such a cute concept, such a cute shirt. I think I got this in a size one, I got this in a size one XL. So, um, without me exposing myself, my mom is coming for me. I already know, but it's okay. Uh, so as you can see, the rhinestone details is the lace that you use or what would be considered lace to tie the shirt in the front. The problem that I have is that when you're trying to lace it, the rhinestones continue to get caught on the fabric. So it, it took like 15 minutes, if not longer, to figure out how to lace this darn shirt up. I stopped, like I didn't even lace it down to the bottom because I'm gonna have to unlace it to take it off for the most part. It's just too much. And um, I, I, don't, I don't even know I don't know guys it's really cute let me know down below what you guys think um maybe I need to tie it tighter or lace it up here tighter do y'all think that'll work why am I talking to y'all like y'all can respond to me like right now yeah I don't know it's just coming untied so let me um hold it like this so you guys can get the gist of it um like I said, I didn't snitch it, or snitch it. I didn't lace it all the way down to the bottom. And if you can look at the top, it is um, stitched on the outside. So at first I thought the shirt was made wrong and that it's inside out, but no, this is how it's supposed to be snitched, stitched. So it's really cute, really cute concept. Maybe if I got it in like a 2XL, it just, I'll have a little bit more room. I don't know, I'll probably give it to my sister and let her figure it out. And I'm not blessed up here, so it, it doesn't help. Doesn't help the call. So I'm not even gonna turn around or anything like that. Like, y'all see, it is what it is. Like, there's nothing, let me pull up my pants. There's nothing to really see. I don't have the shirt on right, but y'all can see the bat. I don't know, maybe I'll figure it out one day and I'll do a whole look. But this is All this right, one. guys, let me show you this beautiful top that I have really quickly. This is a cross wrap exposed zipper back top and I got it in a size one XL. Um, like the title says, it is cropped. It was a little difficult to get into. Um, I don't know if it's just because I'm a little thick, but I digress. Uh, but it's actually a really cute um, top. So it does have like a little bit of a puffy sleeve at the top, which doesn't really stay up well on me. Um, but again, that could be because I'm not really gifted here to really hold or fill out the top to where it would stay. Uh, it is, like I said, it is tighter on, on me. Uh, I did have like a little hard time getting into it. Um, yeah, really good material exposed, um, in the front. Well, I should say V neck really cut low in the front. And then there is a, um, a button at the top that will help you secure it and close it up your cleavage just a little bit and then also in the back there is a zipper that is exposed so i'm going to turn around to let you ladies see this these bottoms that i have on if you're interested i got these from lovely wholesale and i will link that video down below or up top as well so let's take a look at this top So I hope 
hopefully you could see the zipper um, exposed in the back which is actually a really good function because it helps you get into the top just a little bit easier but this is a cute a cute top so all right guys so this one. is the last look i'm gonna show you this is called a drop shoulder um t and tie front shorts I wonder what the drop shoulder means. Is it supposed to? I don't know. Anyway, I got it in a 3XL, so it's extremely big on me, but I love the way it looks. So let me show you guys. It is like a khaki uh, material. If I put the shirt all the way down, you'll see what I mean. Like it's like really big and oversized, but um, that's okay. I'm not intending to wear it like that anyway. So I'm just gonna tuck a little bit of it in the front and bam, got a chic, cute, comfortable look. I actually think I'm gonna keep this on for the rest of the day, but just wanted to show you guys really quickly this set right here. Um, I love how the sleeves are like oversized and balloon too. Like it's so cute. Um, let me go ahead and turn around. Excuse the fact that it is wrinkled. I thought I did a really good job at steaming this, but I didn't. So whatever uh, again I got this in a 3XL the links will be down below to this I actually have one more item so let me show you really quickly before we close out so this is called a twist front ridge crop top and biker short set it, I got it in a 3XL and it was only six dollars <laughs> come on sis winning so this is really really cute um so let me scoot back to show you guys the full look look Whoa, was in the sunlight a little too much. All right, yeah, the sun is going down, so hopefully I got a good look at that. But so you guys can see, it is that ridge, that ribbed um, textured uh, in a beautiful blue or blue gray color. It does twist in the front, but I love the fact it twists in the front, but then it goes down in the back, so it covers your, your you know, your imperfections if you have like rolls or anything like back there, like like I do so no shade um but yeah I really really like this outfit and it's super comfortable um I don't know I may actually leave this one on yeah I think I'm gonna leave this one on versus the other one I don't know I'm, I'm gonna put one of them on for the rest of the day so all right guys um, well that is it thank you so much for rocking with your girl I really appreciate it please make sure you subscribe before you leave I would really appreciate it um and definitely give me a comment down below the only two items that didn't work out I, in my opinion um was this lavender top whoa this lavender top which is so beautiful and then this top right here with the rhinestone chain in the front it, just, it was just too much like it was just too took me too long to tie it up like it was just too much <laughs> so i'll probably see if my sister ron says or I don't know, I'll figure out something with them. But um, leave me a comment down below. Follow me on Instagram, at TrulyGab. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.